The Southwest pilots are organizing regional strike centers that could cause thousands of planes to be grounded during one of the busiest travel times of the season. Organizers say it could happen if their demands are not met. WMER 2 News' Brittany Verner spoke with some of those pilots who outline what this means for travelers. Southwest pilots say their union has been negotiating their contract for more than three years now. Now they're gearing up to potentially strike during one of the busiest travel times of the year. Our contract that we work under with Southwest Airlines expired on the 1st of September 2020, three and a half years ago. That's how long it's been since the Southwest Airline Pilot Association has been negotiating a new contract for pilots with Southwest, one that includes better benefits for pilots. It's more than just compensation. It has a lot to do with our disability. We're the only a union that pays for its pilot's disability as opposed to the company, which is the industry standard. Anthony Mulhair, who's a pilot with Southwest, says other major airlines have all reached agreements within the past 24 months, but Southwest is behind, which not only impacts the quality of life for current pilots, but the company's ability to attract new talent. It's been a frustrating uh, situation for our pilots. And this week, union members made a concrete step to set up a second strike center for pilots. Muhir says this will serve as a regional meeting spot for pilots in the event they start picketing, which is a very strong possibility. We opened one in Dallas about two weeks ago. We'll eventually open one in every pilot domicile. There are 11 domiciles at Southwest throughout the system with Chicago and Phoenix being the next ones that we would open. So that looks like a shutdown of all service at Southwest Airlines. So no pilot would do any work for the company. So at the soonest, we're looking at about the 30th of December, 1st of January timeframe. This will only happen if the National Mediation Board releases the pilots by declaring an impasse in the negotiations. That means around New Year's, during one of the busiest travel times, all Southwest flights could be grounded as long as it takes for the new contract to be finalized. Unfortunately, there's a very real possibility that their travel uh, with Southwest Airlines could be impacted. Our pilots are the most productive pilots in the industry. We fly the most takeoff and landings every day of any pilot uh, in uh, the United States. And it's time for those pilots to be rewarded for the work that they do. It's time to land this contract deal to get this done. If those pilots do strike, we could see them picketing outside of the airport, not just here at BWI, but at various locations where they have strike centers set up. And that could ground Southwest flights until an agreement is met. Reporting from BWI, Brittany Verner, WMAR 2 News. Now, Southwest officials responded saying its negotiations will continue this week. They'll keep working with the assistance of a national mediation board to reach an agreement that rewards the pilots and places them competitively in the industry.